Hi everyone, Liz here. Thanks for stopping by. So we have completed our Living the 30 by 40 Life 22. And to be honest, it's been a lot more successful than I expected. So thank you, thank you, thank you to everybody who took part. It means a lot. So thank you very much. Uh, we ended up with 61 different entries. And I'll just say a quick shout out to Beverly, Cassie, Chris, Crafting with Kay, Days Crazy About Craft, Diamond Painting by Charlotte, who actually got the most canvases completed, which was seven. So well done, Charlotte. That's amazing. Uh, DPN Myers, uh, Girl Willie, Happy Trekker, uh, Jamie NITZ, Jamie Nitz, is it? Uh, Jess Diamond Paints, Karen Young, uh, Lily Rose, Louise Grayson, Marilyn Justin, uh, Moon Do DP, Pell 74, Pencil Surprises, Rebecca Ford, uh, Sandra, oh, Scotty Dog Crafts, that's me, I only did Selena, and Anderson Wilder, who managed to do six, so yay, big shout out to you as well. And I think that's everybody I've mentioned. If I've missed you off, I am sorry. Uh, let me know and I will uh, give you a shout out on my next video. But all of the pictures are all now uh, printed out. These are the last ones to do. Just to show you, I have still got the winners from the previous giveaway, which was Pell 74 and Diamond Painting Fanatics. They did both claim the prizes. So they won't be going back in with those pictures. But they both have done more than one picture. So there are the pictures are in there as well it is one entry uh, in the giveaway for one picture so yeah some people have got one or two like me <laughs> no I'm not in the drawer honest honest uh, and some people have got an awful lot more so yeah so they're all still in there look um, and I'll give them a really really good mix up so that when hubby yeah picks out the winner i think we'll get hubby and millie to do it again because they did such a good job last time and we'll slice these up i'll take mine off as well because we don't want mine in there do we <laughs> be cheaper on postage wouldn't it send myself a prize <laughs> okay we have had some fantastic pictures and i don't think we've had any duplicates uh, i'm not sure there's a couple of known ones that are very similar but i don't think they're the same picture so that's been really really good look at me i'm actually doing this freehand rather than using my cutter would have looked a lot neater using my cutter but never mind okay let's get these bits off and get these folded and put into here so yeah it's been really good fun um I am hoping to probably do it again next year if you fancy joining in. I think um, even if you do the bigger paintings, you know, quite often we do end up seeing pictures that were like on the smaller canvases as well. So, yeah, I might make it a thing. So it's been really good fun to uh, organise and do. And I've loved seeing everybody's pictures. It's been wonderful. But the trouble is, I think when you do these events, um, and I, you know, I like to take part in other people's events as well. Um, I am doing a couple at the moment. Um, Fall Y'all with Diamond Grandma. Uh, Diamond Painting Fanatics Spooky Flings. So I am doing those two at the moment. I've decided I'm not going to do Drills and Chills this year. Um, I don't know. I think I've got enough and I think it's quite a big event um and they do get a lot of people taking part so i'm going to try and support some of the smaller channels uh, this time round doesn't mean to say i won't be doing it in the future but just at the moment i am just going to support the smaller channels so yeah there you are and um, if you have got an event that you would like a shout out on my channel i'm quite happy to shout out and put links to anybody's events um, apparently there is a Doctor Who one coming up, which um, Pencil Surprises has sent me uh, the link to. So thank you very much, Sharon, for sending me that. I'm sure I will be taking part in that because I do like Doctor Who from being scared, from being a very little girl. And uh, yeah, so there's quite a few going on. I think there's a big books one going on in January as well. So I'm definitely going to have to uh, take part in that one because, yeah, I've got a big book, so I might as well. <laughs> okay, actually, 
actually what I'm going to do is tip these out look so that they're not all squished in the bottom okay give them a really good mix round on the desk look so they're having a really good mix and then just put them loosely back in it's a very full tub so I've got a lot more entries than I expected so thank you everybody it really does mean a lot and I love getting your comments as well because I just think yeah it just means there's somebody out there listening <laughs> And watching okay before i go downstairs and get hubby to do that little draw for me um i just wanted to say this is part of my fan cells haul from last time uh, when i did my last pr package unboxing i just thought maybe they didn't have it in stock and um, because they sort of they ask you what you would like and you send a list through of things that you think you know i try and pick things that i've not seen before so that you're not seeing the same thing on everybody's channels uh, and obviously things that i like as well um and yeah there was this little tin on now i thought it was one where you would put crystals on the top and cover the top but it is just a little tin but that's okay because it's metal so i can put cover minders in it um so i will put a link to it down below so it came separately i've had it happen once before i think it was everyday e deals um sent me it was i think it was my, my glasses case that came separately um and sometimes uh, if the manufacturers haven't got the products in uh, they'll send you something as like a replacement or they'll contact you or whatever so you know you don't always get what you say i mean some of the manufacturers there's so much that i like i just send them a great big long list and it's just show, can you choose something for me <laughs> okay so anyway so this is a lovely little tin that i got i'll give it a quick measure so you know it's always uh, best to check um on these sites you know when you are looking at things don't just look at diamond paintings look at the other things as well uh this is about nine and a half centimeters which is just over three and a half inches by seven centimeters two and three quarter ish inches and the depth of it is just about two and a, two and a half, two and three quarter centimetres, just over an inch. So, yeah, it's a nice little tin, as I say, and I will just use it for cover minders. Um, I don't think I'll put diamonds on it. I might do. Um, if I ever get other things done that I've got on my long list of uh, projects, then I might do. But as I said, I did think that this came with them, but obviously it doesn't. But it's still a very nice little tin. It's like one of those, um, like a smaller version of the tobacco tins, you know. Uh, my granddad used to buy roll-up tobacco and they used to come in a tin. I know they all come in like plastic pouches now, but you used to get them in tins. And my dad used to keep them all and put nails on in them in the garage. <laughs> in fact, knowing my daddy's probably still got them in the garage with the nails in. <laughs> okay, so let's get this winner picked. I'll be back in a moment. Right, so here we come. We want to win it. Millie's too busy looking out the window. <laughs> so dig right to the bottom. I'll dig into the middle. Oh, you want that one? Okay. Right, so who was that one? Let's have a look. Oh, you've picked two. Oh, well, we might have to have two then. So the first one is... That is a Lily Rose with this beautiful painting there. Okay. And the second one is then that decided to uh, jump out itself. Can you do it? <laughs> okay. And this one is Beverly. So, oops, it's not wanting to focus. All right, so congratulations to Lily Rose and Beverly. You are the two winners. Yay! Okay, congratulations to the two winners, Lily Rose and Beverly. Uh, yeah, they'd both done more than one canvases. So I believe that the elephant was the first canvas that Beverly did. Uh, she did send me the picture to actually put onto Instagram for her. 
and Lily Rose. I believe this is number two. Lily Rose did four canvases. So this was canvas number two of four. So congratulations, ladies. Um, if you'd both like to get in touch with me via uh, Facebook Messenger or Instagram or by email, my email address is always down below in the comments and I will get your prizes sorted out. So yay, congratulations. So that's our four winning canvases. Very, very different. Lovely pictures. Okay. So, yeah, uh, as I say, thank you ever so much to everybody who took part. It's been wonderful. Thoroughly enjoyed it. Absolutely loved seeing everybody's pictures and taking part. I just wish I'd managed to get more done myself. Uh. <laughs> okay, but wait, there is a surprise. Now, I was only going to do one um, package, but two did jump out so it was only fair um that we did include the two rather than just the one um so yeah and you did see that i'd muddled them all up properly before i put them back in there for hubby to pick out so but yeah if you're very disappointed that you didn't get a prize this time round then i've got another little giveaway to do and this is a canvas that uh, I got from GBFKE. Um, I have unboxed it on the channel and I am actually hopefully doing it as part of my um, DP Spooky Flings, <laughs> DPF Sp Spooky Flings um, with Diamond Painted Fanatics. But if you would like to win this canvas, uh, then if you put hashtag boo just in the comments down below, then I will pick out a winner. Uh, what shall I do? I'll say on the 10th of October. So you've got until the midnight, the 10th of October. That's British Standard Time. And I will pick out a winner to win this canvas. I'll quickly show you it. This is the brand new canvas. This isn't the one that um, I've actually got. As I say, I have got this one as well. And hopefully I will be showing you a completion of it at some point. Uh, but yeah, it's a little, <laughs> a little gnome. Uh, with a couple of little ghosts that don't particularly look scary. Um, we've got a little uh, like diagram down here. I don't know whether it's a snail or what that's supposed to be. But yeah, we've got our little pumpkin gnome with his ghost uh, Halloween outfit on and his pumpkin. And we've got a haunted house in the background and we've got Boo. So I thought we may as well have hashtag B double O as the uh, hashtag in the comments down below and I will do a prize draw um, probably on the 11th of October the day after the 10th just to get everybody a chance to get in so it's around it's 20 colours and it's a 30 by 30 now I did mention in my last video that uh, if anybody would like to take part possibly at the beginning of next year sometime um, in a 30 by 30 challenge so we'll do a live in the 30 by 30 life <laughs> If you've got lots of little 30 by 30s you want to get done, then I'll possibly do a similar thing to the 30 by 40. But it is something, I've enjoyed it so much that I will tr do a few challenges. I'm not going to do one every month because uh, there are a lot of people doing a lot of challenges. And I know it can get a bit much if you're wanting to take part in everything. Um, but there will be giveaways coming along throughout the month of October and right up to Christmas because I've got a few little prizes to give away so keep watching you never know it could be you <laughs> but yeah so this is just a little extra for anybody that's disappointed from not winning there you've got a chance now to win if you put hashtag boo in the comments one of our little gnome pictures okay so I'll parcel this one back up because I'm not going to put this in the cover photograph because you have to watch the video to know about the giveaway. There. <laughs> I'm not giving you any clues whatsoever. Okay, so I'll just pop this back in here if I can get it in this bag. I shall pop it back in that bag in a moment because it's obviously going to play me up and I don't want to be struggling on camera just sending you all to sleep while I'm fighting with a plastic bag. Maybe you'd like to see me fight with a plastic bag. I don't know. I've done stranger things on the channel. <laughs> Okay, well, as always, if you've enjoyed this video, uh, a thumbs up is always much appreciated. And any comments or questions, if you leave them in the comments down below. Uh, if you've got any ideas of uh, any events that you'd like me to do, if there's anything that you've got a burning desire to do, let me know and I'll see if I can maybe have a go at doing it. I'll try anything once, you know me. Uh, or if you've got uh, an event 
or something coming up if you want to uh, let me know in the comments and I'll give you a shout out for it as well. I'm quite happy to share um, anybody's channels, anybody's events or anything. Uh, I just think share the love. Yay. Let's share the love. <laughs> Okay, um, I have done a little slideshow as well of all of the entries into the uh, giveaway, into the Live in the 30 by 40 Life. Um, and I've put it as a separate video, so you don't have to watch it along with this video if you don't want to. It's just a little montage. And then if you're feeling a bit low or looking for some inspiration, you can always just go and watch that video on its own as well. But it does include all of them, all the new ones since the last video I did and all the ones from that video as well. So yay, it's been great fun. Okay, well, that's me done for now. Uh, as always, don't forget to subscribe. So if you press that note, that uh, subscribe button down in this corner, a little bell pops up and it says all notifications and that means you won't miss any videos so you'll be able to find out when the video comes up telling you who won the boo <laughs> okay well thanks ever so much for stopping by and i do hope to see you all again soon bye for now <laughs>